Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel Pisces Soul Tribe, what's going on you guys? Um, hopefully this message finds you in good favor And that you are doing well on your journey If you feel you aren't, of course my intention is to grab a word from the divine To help you to continue to move forward on your journey Pisces Soul Tribe, I want to get into a general read for you And of course anything that you need from me Can be found down below in the description box Okay, let's see. Also, um, I'm not going to be taking any reversals, and um, I'm a deep dive again, so I'll show what cards are necessary. All right, let's see. So, Ace of Swords. So the emperor, mm -hmm. the lovers and the devil. <laughs> okay. Um, the high priestess. Yo. Somebody's intuition is top tier. Like your intuition is is it's it. Like it it, it it it's powerful. I feel like the truth the truth about things get revealed to you no matter what. I feel like this is also something that makes you um, a good listener as well. I feel like somebody here is also a good therapist too. And if you have been considering therapy, consider it. Somebody gets downloads. But like I feel like some sort of movement or some sort of stance that you had to take became very clear to you um, with the five of swords. I feel like somebody at this present time is feeling a little defeated. I feel like somebody is um, also wishing that they were a little more honest than what they were. Um, this is the queen of pentacles. <laughs> But like I feel like at this present time, Pisces, you're in this space where you are not worried about any conflict, especially with the um, Queen of Pentacles. Your concern is what things are nurturing, what things are growing. Um, how can you help, um, if asked, um, edify others? I feel like somebody here is completely um, oblivious and just really not bothered um, by any source of drama, um, any source of conflict. I feel like this is somebody who lie and rest heavy um, and your intuition is very grounded. Um, there's a passion and a fire behind it. And it's clear. Like there is no confusion about any form of download that you get. I feel like this is also something that helps you to make judgment calls and decisions. What else? With the two of pentacles. Page of wands. I feel like there's somebody also in your energy who's tossing and turning with the decision to take some form of action on you. I also feel like somebody in your energy was um, speaking ill against you, possibly. I feel like somebody was also um, projecting things your way as well, especially with this Queen of Pentacles to the Two of Pentacles. Two of Pentacles to the Page of Wands. I feel like there was definitely some form of action um, taken against you. Um, Definitely. Um, I feel like this is somebody you possibly were strongly connected to, especially with the Six of Cups showing itself at the bottom of the deck. I feel like this is somebody young, somebody immature. Yeah, so the Sun and the Fool. I feel like something is being revealed. Yeah, I feel like somebody was speaking up against you um, on, so, on some sort of action that you that you started to take. I feel like there is some light has been shed. Um, some light has been shed on how you're starting over. 
I feel like there was a lot that you possibly um, kept hidden. Um, a lot of things that you were keeping from a lot of people that you um, that you aren't in contact with. I feel like this was also a form of um, protecting yourself. The world is at the bottom of the deck. I feel like there are a few people in your energy who um, who have been paying attention to you. Um, so the movements that you've been making. And honestly, I feel like these are definitely people watching from a distance. These are people that they're not close. They're not close by. Definitely not close by. So the Empress. The lovers. So the Empress to the lovers. I feel like at this present moment, once again, this is this energy is strong. Pisces, I feel like you're you're just taking the route of healing yourself. You're taking the route of nurturing yourself. Um, you are choosing yourself at this present time. You are choosing to um introspect. You are choosing to grow. You are choosing to develop. You're choosing to heal. Um, with the Ten of Pentacles to the Chariot to the Four of Swords. Yeah. You're choosing to heal at the, at this moment. Move into spaces that are definitely peaceful, that are grounded. I feel like you are the total package that you can offer um, this Ten of Pentacles. But like I feel like some action just needs to be taken on some form of, of healing um, that needs to be taken or your movements also need to be just kept silent. I'm keeping your um your heart close to you. Guard your heart is also what I'm hearing. <laughs> okay, let's <laughs> hold on. What else do we have here? Yeah. So I the star as well as the hermit. You're choosing yourself. You're you're healing yourself. I feel like you are really seeking within what desires you really have. Understanding yourself so you can achieve those accomplishments. There's this sense of looking back on who you were when you were a kid. And like, I feel like somebody is feeling like if they can search that space, if they can find that space, um, that space where they really can figure out what made them happiest at that time, um, you can figure out what it is you want to do now. What else? So nine of pentacles, <clears throat> as well as the will of fortune. I, as I said, there's there's a Pisces here who is putting putting yourself first. Has really put you in the space where you have room to be abundant, where you have room to grow. Both the ten of pentacles as well as the nine of pentacles to the will of fortune, and you're not doing this with anybody else. The hermit, as well as the star. The star is focusing on yourself. Cause like I feel like at one point in time you did want the relationship, but like I feel like you move forward, you move forward from that thinking, and you allowed yourself to heal. You allowed yourself to be. You put yourself first, and putting yourself first helps you understand what you really want, what you really want to see happen, um, what you really want to see grow, what you really want to build on, and like I feel like you you chose you. After a lot of chaotic cycles with a lot of um, repetitive people, um, somebody is really choosing themselves, and you're 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 getting growth from that. You're developing from that. Um, what else is important? Ace of Wands, death and rebirth. Ten of Swords. I feel like somebody is having an epiphany. Once again, this is, feels like the energy from last night. Someone's having an epiphany that something really is over. 
Something's not coming back. Something's not returning. Your energy, your spark, um, Pisces, is gone. You've taken it all with the judgment. You, 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 you've taken, you've taken it all back. You've taken it all back. And with the seven of wands, you're, you're blocking things off. What else? Six of swords. <laughs> moving forward, moving on. Ace of Cups. Move, moving forward to things that are new. Um, someone's done with old cycles. Um, someone's done with old people's and the old per people or persons in the capacity where um, you're not letting them get that close to you anymore. I feel like some sort of some sort of emotion to some 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 forms of communication are they're done and someone's moving on with such drive such respect for self is also what i'm feeling i'm hearing the greatest love of all but the particularly the part where 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 um where she says inside of me like i feel like somebody's reclaiming reclaiming their time i feel like somebody's reclaiming themselves almost in the sense of like rededication what else king of swords there's somebody here in your energy who wants to offer you some form of truth um offer you some form of of of, of maybe possibly a change of perspective um, maybe possibly on something that was said, um, how someone left something. I feel like somebody may may possibly gave you um, some form of burden. And like, I feel like this is something that they also wanted to surrender as well. Something that they wanted to give up. I feel like some, somebody wants to offer something to you. But this page of one page of Pentacles to the King of Swords. What else? Yeah, Queen of Cups. This is somebody who wants to offer some form of, of, of an apology to you. Um, speak to you about how, how, how they feel. I feel like this is somebody, as I said, at some point point in time who lacks some form of compassion. But like I feel like being around you and being under you, Pisces, this is somebody who who possibly um, unlocks some emotions, some feelings. And like I feel like this this is now a form and a way of them expressing them. And like I feel like it's like what better time to do that than with the person who showed me how. What else? Yeah, with the Ten of Cups. You showed this person how to do a lot of things. You taught this person a lot of things. But I feel like, you know, there was some form of deception. Like, I feel like there was maybe possibly a lie here. I've, and, like, I'm not saying that it's terrible or awful, but, I mean, it is what it is. What else? Yep, temperance. This is somebody who's talking about how you've changed them. Ten of Wands. Yeah, they've they've learned how to um, they've learned how to carry their own load with the Eight of Cups. Yeah, they they they're they're walking away they're walking away from some form of thinking. I feel like this is somebody who doesn't want to be left out by you. And like, I feel like this is somebody who's definitely following you. But we have the devil here. That's interesting. Temperance, ten of, um, ten of Wands, Eight of Cups, and the devil. This is definitely something that you are supposed to walk away from. I don't feel like this is, this is something that you... Um, I don't feel like this is something that you should be um, entertaining. That's just my opinion. I feel like with the temperance here, with this ten of wands, ten of wands to the eight of cups to the devil, I feel like there's something here that somebody's supposed something somebody's supposed to learn something. 
and definitely i feel like it's somebody somebody's supposed to learn how it feels somebody's supposed to learn how it really feels when somebody really walks away from them to really to like really really be without somebody with the devil I feel like this is this is something that that that's that is inevitable for someone. And like I feel like this is something that that somebody is just supposed to learn. With the Knight of Pentacles, I feel like things are just going to be slow moving for for somebody. Yeah, with the magician yeah, I don't feel like four cups at the bottom of the deck. Yeah. So somebody is um in your energy and definitely in some form of regret. Memories, you know, yet again, as I as I think we're emerging, we might be in a, a retrograde. And if we're not in one, we're in, we're going to be in one very soon. Um, change causes people to to want to see. And boundaries cause people to say, no, you can't do me um, any kind of way. I feel like that's what this is. Boundaries. I feel like people have a problem with them, but boundaries. I feel like that's what people need. Boundaries. I feel like people get disrespected because of lack of boundaries. Um, someone needs to establish some sort of boundary and really stand on your word here. Freedom of will. You can do whatever you want to do. All due respect. But yeah. Uh, anywho, that was the reading. Um, hopefully this message resonated with you in some way, shape, form, or fashion. And you were able to take something from me from it that you can use. Um, Pisces, if there's anything that you need from me, you can find those details down below in the description box. And as always, Pisces Soul Tribe, remember to conquer this day. Bye, guys.